What's going on, everybody? This is another episode of Boxing Therapy. Your host, Lyndon Jones Jr. Um, I just got done watching a couple fights. First one I'm going to cover is uh, Thomas Delorme versus Brian Jones. You remember Thomas Delorme probably from um, the loss he had against Terrence Crawford back in 2015. Because that's where I really remember Thomas Delorme from. But... uh, in this fight, um, it was definitely expected for him to win. Um, he was going against a guy named Brian Jones. The guy had no type of, you know, amateur background or whatever. And apparently, the way he became a boxer was, apparently he was going out to try to be a dancer first. He wasn't doing enough dancing in that fight, apparently, because um, uh, in, in, the, in, in the sixth round, the ref just stopped the fight from uh, just him getting punished anymore by Delorme. Um, even though, De- I mean, Delorme was, you know, the better looking fighter, of course. Um, he, uh, he, he was throwing a lot, like he was, you know, hit, I swear he was hitting Jones with everything he had, but Jones was just staying right there in front of his face, you know, but, uh, he did what he had to do and, uh, the fight got stopped. Um, cause what was the last opponent after, well, see, it was, uh, he just fought Brian Jones. The guy before that was Jesus uh Garola I don't think I don't even think I watched that fight because that was last last June last year in June I don't think I, I don't at least I don't remember watching it anyway but uh he won that one um but uh I I mean I guess I have to see more from Thomas DeLorme because you know he, he's a he's a very good boxer you know he's only got two losses and both of them are by knockout so I mean but other than that, he's a very he's a very solid boxer. You know, he's got he's got good power. You know, he's got skill. So he's 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 pretty good for where he at. Cause he was fighting at a hundred and was he fighting at one forty seven? I think he was fighting at one forty seven for that fight. Let me double check. Was he fighting at one forty seven? Uh, hold on, cause I'm trying. I'm looking at box rec. I'm trying to see if the Fighting at 147. Because I know they make you log in on BoxRec to make you see the weights and stuff. But I believe it was, if I'm not mistaken, I believe it was at 147. I may be wrong. But, yeah, that's that's pretty much I, I, all I got to say to cover that fight. Um, I got a, I got Amanda Serrano fight. I got to cover that one. I got to cover uh, Javante Davis fight. I got to cover... Uh, Got to cover the fight with uh, James DeGale and Bobby Jack. That's the main event. That's coming on soon, actually. So um, I'm going to catch you guys in the next episode. Subscribe to Boxing Therapy. Hit the like button below if you enjoyed the video. And I'm going to catch you guys in the next one. Oh, yes. And I will have highlights for these fights. Not this one in particular, but I will have highlights for more fights on my Instagram page at Boxing Therapy on Instagram. All right. Catch you guys later.